And that's Musicians of Bremen. Ah, <sighs> uh, this... This fight. Okay. Uh, during my original testing, I thought I was gonna have to bring in two people to actually beat this fight. Fun fact. I'll quickly just show you what happens if you go in with something like Salvador's page, which is another really good page. After all. I'm not gonna equip any real pages, because this is just a show. And I, I kind of don't want to show it. it. You just get destroyed. You get staggered first turn, and then you die. Now, what makes G-Con's page important for this one? Let me just put... I have no idea what's going on with that one page, but... Okay, what makes G-Con's page so very important is, if you look at the resistances, our first blunt resists. They don't have, like, a massive downside to them. Thank God. I remember that iron chain... That rusted chains had this, even. And, yeah, we don't even use the bleed gimmick. Like, well, we kind of do, because, uh... Sharpened blade can technically inflict bleed, and it is our main damage source. But... It's not like we built a self-bleed deck or anything like that. Speaking of the deck, you'll notice that a lot of this is surprisingly defensive. That's because of the first turns until you get, what was it? Well, I'm just going to look at this. Until you get alertness, you are in the danger zone. Once you get that, you're fine. You tend to be very fine at that point. But until then, because once you get Alertness and Cocoon, you can actually, like, dodge a lot with these cards. As well, Scattering Slash's 3 protection came in hugely handy. And then our main offense is just 2 Sharpened Blade, 2 Flash of Sun Up. That's all you need with Axe in the deck. You know? Oh, that got a name change. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just... But yeah, this deck is- so yeah, as for luck-based stuff in this, oh boy. Like I said, until you get Cocoon and Alertness, you are in the danger zone. But you almost always have to pick up Axe first to get a positive second. Otherwise you can just get Glitter, Look of the Day, and then probably Social Distancing in all honesty because the game likes throwing that at you. But yeah, you really want Cocoon, because Paralyze, lowering their rolls, always handy. And then, Alertness, lowering their rolls more allows you to dodge more. Simple. And Blunt Resist is huge for this. They use a lot of Blunt and Slash with more focus on the Blunt dice, so... G-Con's page. That's really it. Peace.